looking to score from there, but somehow he's missed it. OK, they've missed a couple of chances so far, but you can take nothing away from their spirit and desire. They look as though they want it more. Hugo Nervo picks the ball up straight from a goal kick. Making good progress down the left, but frankly, devoid of options. Towards the flank it goes. <laughs> Atletico Parana Enze. So far, providing no real test for the opposition goalkeeper. Julio Fuch gives away a free kick. A yellow card. No cause for argument there. Good strong run down the right, now looking though for some support. The referee has given a corner kick. So, how will they work this one? Could be a goal here, possibility for a shot. It's a shot that lacked power. Right in front of the goal like that, he's gone and missed it. I won't have to tell him that's not good enough. Looking to whip one in. No getting it through there, he knew what was coming. Opportunity for a goal. Well, that was really close, but you get nothing for being close. Well, when it becomes that speculative, I think it requires something from the very top drawer, and he had to think a little bit more about that. In the end, he's just opted for raw power. Arsenal on the ball, but not being very threatening with it. Julio Fuch plays it through. No, flags up, just wandered offside, I think. Franco Zuccolini plays it into the danger area. He tried going it alone, but without success. An entertaining game this, both teams have had a number of chances. Alas, it's still nil-nil. Julio Fuch. Pass cut out. Julio Fuch. He goes alone. And they can have another go. Good start.
strike, but straight at the keeper. Yeah, I'm sure he was trying to place it in the corner of the net, but he's not likely to score by firing straight at the keeper. He was close to adding to his tally there. Yeah, he's definitely a player who looks like he can make something happen every time he's on the ball. He's just full of belief and energy. Now, surely, they have it again. It's opened up nicely for him. The first goal goes to Atletico Paranaense. What an end to the first half this is turning out to be. In a straight duel like that, there was only going to be one winner. I just thought he was alert and direct. There was no messing about. He was too quick for the keeper, and that's a fine finish. So we start again at 1-0. Yeah, they may have got the lead, but that next goal now is absolutely crucial to the complexion of this one. Half-time is now upon us. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. It's a cagey game, this one. Plenty to fascinate the spectators, though. Score is 1-0. So, off we go then with the second half. Oh, good challenge, and he's got it back. Making good progress down the right, but finding himself devoid of options. Through and still going. Arsenal were very fortunate to get away with that there. A robust challenge. That'll be the keepers. They've scored on the brink of half-time to make it 1-0. throw Atletico Paranaense still not utilizing their bench Trying to make things happen there for his team, and it almost came off for him too. Looking to play on the break. Franco Zuccolini, spooned forward. a foul and the referee's given it Diego Braguieri with the challenge and he's given away a foul that was always likely to be the outcome yellow card
Julio Fuch. Nicolas Aguirre. Julio Fuch. Yeah, the defence had him exactly where they wanted him there, didn't even give him the space or, or the room to turn. And I think if they can keep him facing the other way, then his threat becomes a much lesser issue. An interception! So here comes the corner. Up to Noddit. No luck there. Well, the defender was stuck to him like glue, but he got his effort away. It wasn't quite enough, though. goes referee just gives the throw that will be a throw in Little in the way of subtlety in that tackle. Atletico Paranaense only have to run down the clock now. Full time whistle within sight. Arsenal needed in the box and quickly. The opposition posing a few questions, but he's able to intercept. Chance, drives it in. That was a good dribble and a good chance. Well, he knew he needed a better angle to get a shot away, and I suppose at least he showed the best option, it just didn't come off. Matias Sanchez has teed up this corner. And it's going to be a corner, I think. No, in fact, a goal kick is given. to receive the ball, break could be on. So there it is, and that concludes today's contest. By the narrowest of margins, they have come